Hello there, ladies and gents. This is part seven, I think, of Dick Souls. I've just been doing these all in a row, so I don't even know what part I'm on now. Editing's gonna be a pain in the ass, though. Not because of how much I have to edit, but because it's gonna take a while. You know what I mean? What do you mean take a while? What I'm trying to say is, is I'm gonna get so far in the game that on YouTube it'll seem like I'm really far back, but I'll probably beat the game before I even upload a part. I don't even know. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I thought my S's flash out. Somebody help me! Damn, I'm fit out. Shut up! I'll use my key. Are you kidding me? I need the residence key just for that. Why is the massacre even in this game if it doesn't unlock that? I I don't get it. Should I save him? I don't know. Maybe I should. How did I even hit that dude? Alright, slurp it up. No shit, it's dead end. I mean, I think I'll go back and buy the merchant key, but right now I don't feel like it. I mean, it's not like it reloads this area. I mean, I can just do that right now. Hello, bitch. My days are not numbered. Alright, I'm gonna buy... You know, I might just buy this for the hell of it. It's only 100. Just to have it if I want to rate something. While this box is useless, because, like, literally, you're, I think your inventory's unlimited. I mean, I guess it helps to organize, but not really. Whatever. Repairing weapons, I might as well buy that. So I remember the first time I played this game, I'm like, okay, maybe I'm sucking because I need armor. So I bought this chain shit, and it's fucking terrible. Um, I don't need anything from you, really. I think I, just, I should just buy this. It's, just, it's useful. Thank you, kind. I don't really need the uh, upgrading shit at the bonfire, but having a repair box at the bonfire is pretty useful. That's a weird sound. So, I'm just gonna run back to where I was. Skip it ahead. Holy shit, that guy just went far. And here we are, back in the hellhole. Which is like a bonfire down here. I mean, it's not too far of a walk. Hey, you. Yeah, that's exactly what I was gonna say. Hit you. I know I could hit you. I guess not. Maybe this weapon is just not, like, built right. Whatever. Wait for it. Gotcha. You think you could beat me? Holy shit. You are an asshole. Gotcha, bitch. These guys are so annoying. Let me heal up. It didn't seem to be doing that much damage, but it added up pretty fast. Guy, yeah, he has to go through him every time, which kind of sucks just to get the capper. I, mean, I guess you could run by him, but I know they could backstab you, which does a lot of damage. Mailbreaker, I know that's not that strong, so I'm going to stick with this weapon I stole from the catacombs. Bust those doors open, boys. Holy shit, why did that do so much damage? Pissed me off. Your damn blood loss shit. This isn't this isn't the catacombs. You can't do that blood shit. I think that's everyone except I remember there being more dogs coming up. I got your set, your armor set, you assholes. Yeah, there's dogs right here. Oh my god, just die. That set useful for me. Black leather, I don't even remember getting that. That's, that's really light, actually. I've been using this because it was light. It's leather armor. I mean, it... Wait, actually, is that what I just got? Actually, never mind. I think that just is the feast stuff. Yeah, it's lighter and it does more, so it's basically better in every way. Except for lightning defense, but who the hell cares? So yeah, this stuff's actually good. It's actually nice to be using the armor I wanted to use before, because I was always using this heavy armor. 
no point wearing it though, because this helm's great. Gives me so much more defense. It somehow doesn't weigh me down. So I'm liking my setup I got here. I don't like my old setups where I always fat roll. It also it looks nicer than being a fat, ugly, chainmail idiot. I feel like there's like a shortcut over here that makes Capra even easier. Because I remember, I don't like going that way because the thieves get in my way. Oh, I remember. Like, you could actually make it... I usually just stay at the Firelink Shrine because you could just run past all those enemies while these guys are kind of annoying to run by. Oh, not these two, but... I don't remember. I just preferred having this way open, I believe. I'm not sure if it's actually faster, but... This is the way I usually take to get the Capra Demon. To fight him, not to get to him the first time. Because you have to open this from this side, I believe. And this is the other tower I always get confused with the Havel one. Got a vendor right here. Buy her mosses, even though you can get them for, for free. You get a piece of shit if you want, don't buy. Shark call. I, I don't I don't know if that's good or I know it's good for Capodemian, but I don't know if it's better than having lightning, which I already have free, so. This is Are you so creepy? Oh, shit, it's a bad time. <laughs> don't run off, I'm walking off. Dumbass. Alright. Now if you open this, you'll get back to the fire link. Man. Would I rather have the fire link or not? No, I think I'd rather have the fire link one. Cause I really don't want to go for all those thieves and shit. Oh, get out of my way. I was gonna do the Capra Demon right now, and just say who cares about heat resting, but... I don't think I could beat him with just one Estus Flask, no offense, but... Well, I'm gonna say no offense. Everyone knows he's hard. It's not hard, just the dogs are gonna hit me, I know that. Oh, come on. You're putting my flame out, you assholes. How many times have I killed you and how many times have you killed me? Only one of you guys has an actual kill on me. And it's the guy who threw the firebombs at me. Alright. Let's run back to the Capra Demon. What the fuck? I've never died there before, what the hell? Like, well, from up there, I mean, the first time I've ever fallen from there was, uh, the fireball. I'm not kidding, that fireball is the first time I got killed there, and that was the second time I've, I got killed in that area, but I'm never from up there, though. That's an awkward death. Usually these guys are easy as shit, what the fuck was that about? Oh, come on, you barely hit me. Alright. I should just run by them, there's no point fighting them, at all. Only problem about this good world design though is those walks are long, like just that one long hallway makes it so boring. But, that's what you gotta do if you wanna make the world connected, I guess. Man, I really wish they had fireplaces close to the boss battles, it's the only thing I think is bad about this game is... Well, not the only thing, but that's one of the biggest problems of this game. That, I don't mind it being hard at all. Like, Orange and Smoke would be even harder, I wouldn't care how hard they are. Just the fact that you have to run to get to them, and I hate the Anor Londo run. This run's actually not that bad, because these guys are easy to kill, and you can just run by these guys. Anor Londo is so annoying, because you, if you kill them, it takes it's hard as hell and you might die. If you don't kill them, they always hit you in the back, the Silver Knights, and those big guys are a fucking pain in my ass. It's just bad game design, my fan. But, whatever. Like, for example, like Cuphead, like, those bosses are really hard, but you can just do them immediately again. God, just die. Oh. So I'll be going into this with a Estus. It's so weird. Estus Flasks are so weird because it's literally my last name, but it's flipped one letter. Alright, so... I'm gonna place this gold pot now. Let's hope I don't waste it and die instantly. Let's see if I can do this. I 
push. I don't have Estus out. God damn it. Holy shit, these dogs are annoying. Jesus Christ, you probably saw that sped up, but my god, they're annoying. So I got one gold pine resin left. I don't know what the hell happened, like I was doing... Nah, I was not getting hurt that bad, all of a sudden, I accidentally tried to heal on a gold pine. And then all of a sudden I noticed my HP was really low and I just died. I guess I got blood loss from a dog, but god damn, those dogs are annoying. He wasn't doing that much to me, so... Whatever. Now I have S's out, which is good. I gotta make sure to kill his dogs as early as possible. Cause he doesn't do that much as you can see there. It's those dogs you gotta watch out for. right under me? He is. You idiot. I could just plunge you. Wow, I am bad at fighting you. Too bad. I have lightning, so it doesn't matter. Dead meat. Lightning really tears his ass up. Man. I'm not used to fighting though, because like he's actually not that hard, because like the dogs is what kills you every time. So when you actually fight him, but you're not used to it. Because he dies pretty easily too. See that boss can be really annoying, especially for a first timer, but that's how you do it. Lightning, kill the dog watch, that was actually a pretty bad run actually. Because you really want to kill the dogs quickly, and I had no idea what I was doing there. Alright, so we got the key to the depths now. This video has been going on for like 20 minutes probably, but there's only like 5 minutes of footage because I just had to run back so many times. I only, I only died like twice though. Anyway, let's go to the depths now. I'm glad that didn't take too long though. That could be really annoying sometimes. Because he has one of the longer runs to his boss room. The only runs that isn't that bad is like the the, the run the cis battle isn't that bad. I mean it's a little long, but there's nothing really that's gonna kill you. And I actually like that boss. It's fun. Um, the sanctuary garden is how you do a boss battle. The fire is right there. You don't have to run at all. Even though I, that boss is kind of annoying in my opinion, because it's way too fast. Where the hell is the staircase? Am I forgetting how this place goes? Oh, it's here. I completely forgot how this place went. Oh my god, I hate those guys. They're so annoying. Just the torch ones. I don't know why that, that attack does so much goddamn damage. I mean, I know a lot of people hate those guys. But no one ever talks about those, nut, those hollows with the shields. I hate them, and no one talks about how much they suck. I hate them because of that one attack, that little... That run up and they poke you. I fucking hate that attack. It's so annoying. Just something under gets under my skin. Alright. Oh shit, there's a shortcut up here. This whole game's a shortcut. Man, I'm like so close to one hit these guys, but I'm not. Which is annoying. Alright, there's a dog down here. I hate these dogs. As you saw from my sped up clip, these dogs are so annoying. Because they attack so fast. They, so you just keep getting stuck. Well, thankfully, it's like the only area I think that has dogs in the game. Come on. I don't want to fight your mother. I just want to fight you. And kill you. And they also, they jump out of the way just side all the time. Like that. 
Oh, come on. You got your mom to fight? Why am I calling it the mom? I know it's a woman, actually. But, why am I It's not the mom. Damn, how am I so low on S? I guess I use it in the battle. Where did Granny go? Oh. What the fuck are you doing down there? Get your ass up here. These guys suck, actually. They look threatening, but they kind of suck. Especially because they only die... They die once and they're gone, so it's like, oh. You think they'd be stronger for someone who dies once and they're dead. Oh, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Apparently not. Apparently not. Where's my backstab? Where is my backstab? Where is my super suit? Gotcha, bitch. Oh, you fought. That made me so easy to dodge. And you did it twice. What an idiot. I called you a he, you bitch. How's it feel? Give me your sack. 10,000 souls, really? That's a lot more than I fought. Well, actually, 10,000 is not that much. At this point in the game, it's actually becoming less and less. I know it's a hidden path. I thought it was the actual path you're supposed to take when I first played. And it's way better. Alright, anyway, let's go kill this fucking rat. Spider shield. I think that gives you good poison resistance. Or something. Wait, there is no poison thing with Jiggy. Better physical and fire. And, eh, I think the grass is probably still wetter. I remember it being good for something. Oh, that did not do as much as I thought. I don't think I got the full animation on him. Which is kind of odd. Yeah, a guy there. I don't know why that didn't work. Like, I did a plunge, but the thing is, I thought the enemy has like plunging animation where you hit him and it's like, that's a lot of damage with an animation. So I've definitely killed him in like two hits before. I don't know. I guess, I guess I'll try it again. I'll go all the way back, because his depths are in a shitty location in this game. Well, this should really be a bonfire. Um, around the Capra Demon area. They should have made Lower Undead Burg a much larger area, put a bonfire there. I'm not saying this area is that hard, it's really not that hard, but it's not fun to get through. And plus the lower undead burg is way too small anyway. Oh, I gotta fight this torch guys again though. I'd rather have the granny be alive again than fight these guys. Not those guys, those guys are easy, but these guys, I hate them. Always the jumping attacks. Oh, that was lucky. God, they're like 1 HP from dying, I really want to level up uh, strength. Just one more, I guess. Oh, goddamn, you're alive. See, fuck these... Oh my god. This is a bad spot to be in. Thank you, Paul. I do have the blue thing. Blue thing? What am I talking about? The blue, uh... Ring, which will help me. Also, I'm surprised the Ring of Favor isn't helping that much, like... How weak would I have been if I didn't have the Ring of Favor? Because you're not supposed to have this ring this early, it's the best ring and I already have it, which is kind of weird. Alright, I really want those souls, because those are- t I had 10,000, I believe. There we go! I guess I just wasn't far in ago. Jeez. 
to like suck or something? Two more hits, I think. More hits than I'm dead almost. But I should have met. Thank God for that opening. Oh, that was awkward. Oh, I thought I hit him there. Alright, there we go. Mini boss done. Give me my humanity. My souls, your soul is mine. Sewer chamber. Oh, it's an invisible blood stain, I guess. Bastard. I don't think I'm. I don't think I'm going, supposed to go this way, but the depths are kind of a maze. Yeah, there's no point going that way. I know that. Um, I remember you can, there's a lot of enemies over there, there's like a sorcerer guy, a channeler, I mean, he's annoying. But I believe if you go on the left side here, yeah, there's like a little secret path. We can kind of, it's like a sh shortcut, that's a big shortcut though. That, ma that makes the depths extremely easy right there. Guess that's the boss battle that way. I want to get to the bonfire, which I believe was... Because we haven't unlocked the shortcut yet, we'd be this way. Although I think we just got the key, so we should be good. I don't know why this area is so loud with the water and shit. Yeah. yeah that, that's how you make the depths really easy. Because they can be annoying. You don't have to deal with the basilisk at all, and their stupid curses. I'm so upgrading strength. Not that I need it, but just... Like, the fact that those guys... It's not that they die in two hits, it's the fact that I barely do it in two hits. Like, I'm so close to one-hitting them. So let's do 20, it's a nice round number. Alright, so this boss is kind of annoying because he does... Not damage, but he just... Takes so many hits, so I kind of... what I might just put all in the strength right now. Just so I can get through this guy. The gaping dragon just takes forever to kill. He's not that hard, but he's just annoying. So I'm just going to do a bunch of strength right now, and then I'll just upgrade the rest of it after I beat him. Like, I'm not going to use strength for a while. All my level ups after this. It's not like strength's going to be way higher. Alright. I should be one hitting these guys 100%. You know what? Also, might as well do this. And there's one of those. Handle this bitch, make it a little bigger. See how tiny that flame is? Let's make it a big boy flame. A little bigger. Alright, now we got our 10 Estus flasks. Now what I'm going to do now is this optional, but I kind of, I think there's some good items, and I want to kill the other Franny. So if you didn't take that shortcut I took at the very beginning, there's like two shortcuts in this level. Um, oh, I'm so used to two hitting them. There's uh, another way to go up there, which is through here. Watch out for this guy. Not today. These enemies are still probably the lamest enemies in the game. They're literally just shit, I think. Super easy to kill. The attacks are so slow and do no damage. The only thing they have is HP. I mean, I think that, that if they do a lot of damage, they fall on top of you, but that's pretty rare. Except for that guy, but you just dodge him. Alright. There we go. It's 
this Sarah? There he is. Oh, I, I thought I was gonna show that he's up top there, but he, she decided to jump down. Oh shit. Well, I missed and you missed. How do you feel now? Oh, I probably would have staggered your ass. Backstab. They might actually not be she's. I think I heard someone said they are she, but I don't think they are. Or maybe they are, I don't know. They're pretty buff to be a woman, but... Ah, you hit me. I hit you, but you didn't hit me, bitch. Shut up and die. Give me your sack. They always drop the sack there. It's cool looking, but it's kind of pointless. Unless you want to be like a Resident Evil 4 flashback. It gives me nothing. It just looks cool, but... That's has great poise, actually. I don't know if I'd really want it over the fence, though. And I don't think it even looks that cool. I mean, I know if you want fashion, but I really don't think it looks that good. You. Yeah, 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 please. You must... I'll help you. Pyromancer. Great swamp, blah, blah, blah. Let's go back to Firelink Shrine. Don't you give me something? Oh, no, that's it. Roll and roll and roll. Oh, I completely forgot the guy in the lower end at Berg. Uh, I, I bought the key just to save him, and I never used it. Um, I could go back and do that, might as well. You know what, I'm not even fighting these dogs. I'm just, these dogs, I hate, because they jump sideways in here. And now we're back here. What I'm going to do is, because it's actually not that far away. Why are you guys all respawn? Oh, because I, <laughs> I rested at a bonfire. I am going to... I don't really care if I die, because... I, ha I already rested the bonfire. I just want to get to the door. I hear footsteps, but I don't see them. Why don't I go up the stairs? Just to be fancy. Yeah, I do hit these guys now, that's pretty nice. Let me try to throwing knife me. Can it work? Hold up, what'd you drop? Leather armor. Your footsteps. I'm just gonna watch this way just in case. I thought that ghost was an enemy. Hollow thief. I thought I was already wearing that, the black leather. This gives me lightning, but it weighs a little less. It doesn't look that good though, so, and I don't really need any weight, so who cares? I hear you puppies, I hate you. puppies. Uh, you guys do not deserve to be called puppies, I hate you so much. One hit shot. One hit shot, one hit kill. Where's it with me and Miss Sang shit in this let's play? I might do a Resident Evil 4 let's play after this. I was gonna do one a long time ago, but like, Premiere was fucking up, and I'm just like, screw it. I mean, if you didn't know, I pirated Premiere, and it's sometimes it's a pain in the ass, but it's less of a pain in the ass than paying for it, because fuck Premiere. Or fuck Adobe, I mean. I don't know why they charge so goddamn much. Like, I'm not paying, like, like 25 a month just to get a fucking program. Like, I would pay, if it was, like, I don't know, like 10 a month, maybe? Even that's a little, that's about as much as Spotify, I guess. I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Oh, no, I'm going the right way. He's right over here. This door? Oh, it's this one. Oh, you gotta be shitting me! I died right there? Are you fucking kidding me? What? All that for a drop of blood? Are you fucking serious? right there all 
Alright, well after dying twice doing that shit, I'm fucking done. Like, I lost those humanities, that was the only reason I was going up there anyway. I'll just do it back when I, um... Oh my god, dude. You go back to Firelink Shrine, so... Eventually, after Blight Town, so... That guy's gonna have to wait, he'll stay in that fucking tomb the rest of his life. What's over for this way? Oh, this is the shit you'd have to go through if you didn't use the sh shortcut I did. That's why I'm still under level. I feel so weak against these all these guys. Maybe it's because I didn't go through the depths at all. Just cheated through it, basically. Like, it's amazing how much of a depth you could just skip. I mean, I I'm gonna tell you one thing. I'm skipping through the fucking Basilisk section. There's no point in going through that hellhole again. Oh, the Great Axe. Oh, that well, it, well like, I don't need this dark sign, I really don't. And I guess I could just put homewards there. See, that's why you want to have those poison moss clumps here, it's for this part of the game. Jump scare. Oh, come on, I hit you. I hit you first. I forgot that that great axe is going to be really helpful. Because I know for a fact that does about a 140 damage, I believe. I know I'm going to be able to two-hand it at least. I might make that like a fire great axe or some shit. Because I might be using that for a lot of the game. So there's much. If this is Lucerne, I did not think I'd be using this long, but probably not much longer. Look, can I use this yet? No. Once I'll be able to use this two hands, I should be good. Like, for Lucerne. So what is this, 24? I'm getting pretty close, so yeah, the Lucerne is going to run out soon. That's why I didn't really upgrade it at all. Great Axe, 32. Yeah, it's going to take a while, but I could two-hand this for a while. I should have... I usually just do two weapons. I'm surprised I just do it one. I forgot I could probably double-hand the this Y-hander, but it doesn't matter because I have the Great Axe now. So I was like having two weapons, a strong and a light, usually. Oh, that does make... Oh, I know why I wasn't doing this, because of, uh... You know, um... Weight and shit. So remember that door I was like, I don't want to go there because there's a channeler and shit like that? I'm not doing this shit. Not today. No siree. See it all connects, you know, it's like poetry, it rhymes. And there's there's nothing really special out here, I believe. I don't think there's any items I particularly want in the depths, other than the great axe I really wanted. Normally if you keep going down those paths, you'll get to the um area where you're supposed to go. And then you, it takes a long time, actually, to open up this shortcut, um, right here, this, there's a stairwell here, like, or this whole stairwell, yeah. Well, I was like, oh, there's a stairwell here, no shit there is. It takes a while to open this stairway. Yeah, you come up from over here, I believe, this is, um, where the basilisks are, which, I guess I could show those guys. They're assholes. Last time I played this, I didn't get cursed at all, and I went I went through every item and I did not curse. I got really lucky. I'm probably gonna regret this. I'm probably gonna get cursed now. Trying to find these guys. I feel like there was some good items. I mean, I know I'm gonna miss out on some souls, but maybe I'll come back to this place. Oh god, there they are. So these guys are like these weird frog things, and they can curse you, and that halves your health, and it's really annoying. But as long as you're careful, you can combat it. Like, I didn't even get hit there. So those guys are probably the scariest enemy for all the wrong reasons. I don't want to go much third, unless there's like an item that's really easy to get. 
I don't see anything though. Oh, there's one. Okay, a yeah, soul. That won't be useful. Oh, they even rattle. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna be done for now. Maybe I'll come back here because I kind of want to get every item. Oh, there's some items I still have no idea to get. Not today, boys. I'm not doing the depths today. Alright, if I fail the Gaping Dragon more than three times, I'll go through all that hell. But if I get cursed, I'm quitting the game and stopping the Let's Play. <laughs> okay, that's a bad idea. What the fuck you? Pushing me back? I got hit by the slime guy, so I never get hit by. So this guy goes to um, the bridge and fire link once you beat the uh, gaping dragon and shit like that and blight town. Gives you crystal shit. He also gives you like smoke's armor and shit like that later on. I don't think the lightning's that useful for um. It might be actually. You know what? I might just buy it because I don't. I... These souls are kind of pointless anyway. Like, thousand souls isn't that much. Wait, really? I didn't know divine weapons. Oops. I'm assuming it's like skeletons could like revive themselves. But I didn't know divine weapons could stop that, or maybe they just do more damage. All right, I'm gonna be going into this battle with five Estus. That's not horrible, but I could do better. I'm gonna see if I can beat this first try. As I said, if I lose three times. If I lose, yeah, well, technically, if I, if I die twice and then, yeah, two times I die. Whatever. Yeah, we'll do it in the battle because I think it's a this is a very big room. It's a creepy place to be, by the way. You know, down here in the depths. Oh, it's a little alligator, cute little bastard. He's got a lot of teeth on him. Hairy little fella. And he's got a big vagina. You know, you're the ugliest dragon I've ever seen, though. Why do you have such a fat ass, though? I'm cutting that tail off, dude. Every enemy, for some reason, you can cut the tail off. I don't know why. He looks really cool, though, when he does that. Oh, this guy's not too bad. He just takes a while to fight. See, as you, even though that's actually good damage. Oh, fuck. I did not know that. The Chandler will fight you? Now I know why I kill that guy. I have never known that. The Chandler will hit you if you don't kill him. That's gonna suck. Maybe I should have killed him. This might take more times than I fought, guys. Come on, put your gaping dragon down. Fight me. Oh my god, because of that Chandler, that fucked me over. Lightning's gone. Oh, I'm doing no damage. That is odd. Okay, I should probably use Great Axe. You don't have to be that fast to this boss anyway. Alright, I think I got out of the range with Chandler at least. Yeah, I'm doing good damage to his tail though. If I die here though, I'm gonna kill that Chandler. But it's actually a cool game design. I know there's the, um, in Sense Fortress, you have to kill that giant. I know that, which is similar to this. A giant will attack you if you don't kill him in the Iron Giant battle. But I didn't know this battle had the same shit. Alright, so I'm going to stick to the tail because it does a lot more damage than his face. Although the face is a lot easier to attack this. This shit takes forever. As you can see. Patience, my friend. And it'll do that. It's like, come on, dude. I'm just trying to kill you. Let me kill you. His paws are annoying. Though. Paws? I, I guess they're paws. I saw that blue shit. Don't, 
I saw that. If I could beat this guy with a Chandler, that's gonna be pretty cool. Man, having good stamina regen is actually making this way easier, though. Don't fuck this up. There we go. That's a very good weapon, but I'll never be able to use it to like New Game Plus because it needs so much strength to use it, like 50. But it's a very strong weapon. It's probably one of the strongest in the game. And now he can't use his tail. Asshole. Yeah, there we go. That's. So now his ass is really a weak spot. Too bad the Chandler's pissed me off, though. I don't know why he doesn't attack him unless like stand still. Oh wait, is he powering him up? Oh shit, is that why I'm doing so little damage? I just realized that. I might be doing less damage because of the channel. Or is it just or did he just do it now? Either way, I'm fucking dead. Damn it. God damn it. Chandler's making him stronger. But, like, I didn't see that effect before. Or maybe I just never fought him with the effect on. If you know what I mean, like... What's the fastest way to get to that guy? So I think he only powered him up at the end of the battle, so he actually might not have been. Unless the effect just wasn't showing up, I don't know. I'm just gonna use big boy for this. One hit, one hit kill these guys. Oh, those are the big white rats. No wonder they're doing more damage to me. Actually, they're not. Huh. No, they are big. They are big rats. Cause these are the little guys. All right, I think this way was a way to the Chandlers. Fuck off. And I should really have my sealed out for this shit. Actually, I think the curse resistance is the spider shield. I think that's what I remember. Come on, frog, get out of here. I think there's two in there, so I don't want to risk anything. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can hit him from here. Got him. It's gonna make it a little easier. I hear another one, though, that's not here. God, I was so pissed off when I got cursed for something I had no idea what the hell I was doing. I'm like, what the hell happened? I did not know, understand these guys at all. But if you're careful, they're not that bad. But, obviously, you gotta be very careful, because it's really scary. Because getting cursed is annoying. Having to run back and buy the curse bite shit. Shit, that. Oh my god, I almost got cursed by accident there. Ooh, I have death. I think it's a PvP thing, so I don't really care. Oh shit. You scared the fuck out of me. Where'd you come from? Were you the guy down there? That's just gonna be nice to hear the guy down there, because now I can hit you. I think it was, okay. Okay. This item. Falling down those holes, it just takes you to a basilisk area. Which is where we already are anyway. Oh, that guy's still down there. Can't plunge him though, which sucks. I don't know why- oh god, no. Not three at once, I'm not- I'm not doing a plunge, because that's gonna leave me wide open. Shit! Ooh, that was close. Okay, I got one hit on him. That's two of them. I think there's just one more. I'm gonna plunge you. I think we're the last one, that's why. Yeah, this is the area I usually fell down right here and this how I got cursed. I'm like, what the hell? You fall down right here and you fight this guy. And if you kill him and you got like five more to go through it. So you really have to know what you're doing <laughs> the first time around. And this is what it looks like when you get cursed. Ooh. 
Eh, it's not really. It gives you HP from fallen enemies, but that's not going to be really useful in a boss battle. And I think I just defeated every basilisk in the area. Yeah. That's the entire basilisk area. I got most of the good items. I think there's a couple more items in, like, the, the thin rat caverns. There's, like, those thin passageways. And if you fall down those holes, that's how you get there, but... It's not the way I wanted to go, though. I wanted to get to... The, uh... Second floor of the Gapey Dragon fight, basically. Which would be up... Not there. Actually, it would be up here. Right? Yeah, it would be. Although, I don't mind this area that much. Once... Like, the first time you hate it, but then you actually appreciate it. It's a pretty cool place. Let's get the Great Axe out. And miss. I'm glad these rats are pussies, though. Not the big ones, though. I, I, I ran out of stamina for a second. It's hard to tell if they're alive or they're ragdolls sometimes. Seriously, I do not understand how the Estus shit works. All of a sudden, sometimes you just get a random flash out of nowhere. Maybe it's like another player who dies? I don't know. I'll look that up, actually. Maybe. Don't you dare come at me. I'll oh, he's running away. What a pussy. I, was, I thought he was going to charge me. I guess not. You little friends. Why do they always hang out in these corners here? Don't make me... Ah, uh, I'm going to poison again. Whatever, I got two more. See, this is the uh, alleys I was talking about. This is the only area I haven't really explored all the way, is these places. Now, if I could get one of you guys to come up and fight me, that'd be nice. Ooh, one hit kill, that's gonna be nice. Oh, that guy's gonna be an ass, though. Okay, he can't hit me, that's good. I'm not risking anything with him, so... I'm gonna use this. How'd you power up yourself? Dodge. Well, not really dodge, I was just like, fuck you, I hate you. Can't believe you were powering him up, I never knew that. I know you're in ambush. <laughs> How can I never hit that, though? There we go. Oh, they got me. Very nothing. Oh, there is someone here. Large Titanite. That was nice and quiet. Just my souls down there. I don't hear fire. Oh, there's a torch. I'm like, why do I hear fire? Give me fuel, give me fire, give me that which I desire. Are you powered up? Yep, because you're not wanting to kill. At least you don't stagger me like those damn dogs do. there because I wasn't sure if like, my recording was stopped or something. Okay. I'm doing a running hit and you're still alive. I thought I one hit- oh actually I do- I'm an idiot. I don't one shot them, it's just because of uh... My Witch McCall is what I thought my Great Axe made me think I could. That takes you there, see that's the whole depth pretty much. I think I got every item. I don't know where they else they'd be. And I've been through all the depths before, and I can't remember anything else, so... That waterfall just takes you to the, um... The Basilisk area with those frogs. So there's no point going back there. If I missed an item, who cares? I don't remember anything special. Alright, what we're gonna do now is, uh... 
me just go for it. I don't have any lightning, but I don't really care. I guess I could show you that dragon weapon I got. He's gonna have his tail magically regrown, probably, but... See, 380, but you need 50 for it. Like, I can't even one-hand that forever. Or I can't even two-hand that for a long time. Alright, let's see how much damage we do now. Let's see if we actually had the, uh... Thing going on. I already have the warrior set. I mean, I guess you'd get that if you didn't have it. Or so his tail's back, which kind of sucks, but... I might just fight him normally, though, because now the Chandler's gone, I can just do the uh, face attack. Okay, yeah, he did buff him, but then... Oh, that guy didn't get hit in the middle. I got hit by his fucking toes, though. Damn it. Roll that. I was using a tail attack, I guess. That roll. Let's get at least two hits on him before he charges you. Oh, he's not charging. Hot miss, bitch. This guy looks way creepier than he really is to fight, though. Well, I'm fat rolling now this great act. Maybe I should just uh, use the Lucerne, but for this battle, I can't, you don't need to worry about not fat rolling. And plus, the damage is very helpful. This guy has so much health. God. There we go. I only got hit once, which is good, by his toe. <coughs> I just want to cut his tail off. Not for the weapon, but... So he doesn't have to hit me with it. This green shield is so helpful, by the way. I've never had it this early in the game, so... Oh wow, that did way too much. Are you fucking serious? Did you see how close I was to surviving that, by the way? I was gonna be like, oh, that's such a clutch right there. I'm like, okay. I should have healed, too. I was like, okay, I'm just gonna heal here. But I'm like, uh, maybe that attack's gonna hit me. But I'm like, I know what attack it was. It's just a swing. God, I'm an idiot. Because if I healed there, I wouldn't have had to roll back that way. But damn, I thought I was gonna make it. Because like, I was like, oh, I'm gonna make it. And then I just fell. I've never fallen there before. That's a first for me. At least the gaping dragon walk's not too bad. How much weight do we have, though? Oh, a lot. That's wait, no. If I get rid of this, will I have enough? For just this. Oh, I do. Huh. Oh, I was gonna buy lightning, but I don't even think you could use it on the Great Axe then. Plus, uh... I don't have any souls. Alright, for now, I could just run this. I mean, I still get the stamina from the shield, even though I can't use it. And I could just block this. Eh, I'm, I'm probably going to stick with this turn for regular- I'm, The boss, obviously, I'm going to run like this, but for the rest of the game, maybe not. Because I prefer having a shield. It makes me feel safer, I guess. Alright, let's hit you. Let's sniff it up. Hit him again by accident. I want to get greedy there. And this should be my best run. There's, this boss is not that hard. And I was doing pretty well, but both times I got bullshitted. One by the Chandler, which I almost beat that one, by the way. And the second time by Gravity. Because it's Dark Souls. Gravity is your biggest enemy. No one ever tells you that before you play Dark Souls that Gravity is going to be your biggest enemy. Oh, I thought I rolled. I just, I, I was so close to rolling there, but not quite. 
Pokemon hit me. Or s try to slunk me. Not like that. I meant, I want you to slam your body down. That sounds weird. Oh shit, you're way too close. I was getting too close to the edge there. So I didn't want to get trapped. I might as well get my souls then. Hold up, he's giving me an opportunity to hit him. I'm not missing this up. Don't worry about the souls though. It's not important. What's more important is make sure he's dead. Why did I roll there? I thought he was gonna hit me with his tail, I guess. I got scared. Oh shit. Save your stamina, dumbass me. Why am I yelling at myself when I'm doing it? I'm like telling myself how to play. Oh uh, shit, save your stamina, I just said it. Okay, I got lucky anyway. I like, actually I really like this block though, fighting him. It's not, it's fair and it's fun. Except this tail can get kind of annoying sometimes. When it hits you. Well, he doesn't seem to be using it, he seems to be like a fly. I can, like if he doesn't hit me with his tail, that means he's gonna fly pretty much. I forgot he could do that. And I guess he is capable. He is the boss of adept, so you'd think he'd have something like that. You know what I mean? It'd be kind of weird if he didn't have something like that. Boss, take forever to fight. That's the, another thing. You are such a long boss. Not as long as Warranty and Smo, though. Come on. You were so creepy, though. How am I supposed to punish that? Oh, he almost punished me, though. I can tell you that right there. I will cut your tail off. Cut it off. Cut it off. I kind of want to cut it off. I'll do it again. I'll do it again. I'll do it again. Dare me. Oh, you're going to be a little bitch, aren't you? Don't make me do it. Don't make me do it. Uh, ignore that. Come on, dude. Just die. You and your tail are going to... Oh, shit. Uh, I might not get his tail though. This would be a great time to heal, by the way. Come on, dude. This is my first time actually fighting you with not BS. <laughs> what am I talking about first time fighting with not bullshit? That was my fault that I rolled off the edge there. Uh, could you attack, dude? Might as well just heal this for the hell of it. Just to, just to mock him. Last hit. <laughs> yes, the last hit did it. I, I went for a strong attack just for the hell of it. So it would have killed him no matter what. Now that's how you do it. That was actually really fun. That's probably the most fun I've had in this game. And that'll be the end of this part. Thanks for watching. I got 25,000 souls. Now we're going to do Blight Town. That was really fun.